Brakatia Hawa, Brakatia Shai, Brakatia Hawa, Brakatia Shai, Brakatia Hawa, Brakatia Hawa, Shai, Brakatia Hawa, Brakatia Hawa, Bashim Yawa Shai, Bahashim, Kakodash, the blindness of the apostles and the elders of Great Mill, some which you well. Salutations to the hopeful elect out there, you Akim to Sadakim, that do this thing in the utmost truth and sincerity. On the Prishaman, this week's topic is going to be entitled, It's All Coming to Light, or It's All Coming Out. Uh, the inspiration comes for the show because uh, this channel here, Black Avenger, uploaded a video of uh, this brother, a former IUIC IU, member. And I remember Apostle Tahar bumped into him and he actually mentioned that in the video above. He actually mentioned, he actually said that actually caused great resentment at the time towards Apostle Tahar because uh, pretty much Nate pulled him up and embarrassed him or something like that. Um, but yeah, I remember this this uh, brother's face. And anyways... Um, <clears throat> He was apologizing to the ISCPK for G and GMS and all these other camps. He they must have offended because apparently at the IUIC, they do propaganda tactic tactics and you know disinformation tactics. Um, I think one of the things he mentioned. I'm not done with the video. Was uh, they'll set baits out for brothers. You know they'll they'll set things up to make it look like the IUIC is going off. Um, which the IUIC do go off, but pretty much set up a situation to make it look like they had their own cryptocurrency and sold out. And brothers jumped on it, took the bait. Uh, you know, I, I wasn't aware of this, but said I don't know which member in the camp took the bait, but brothers took the bait, ran with it, say, say, see, IUIC sold out, and then it came to light that you know the the video was inaccurate, and the the tactic and the motive of, of that was to discredit anything you bring out now in the IUIC. So these are some of the remember these guys are former law enforcement, maybe still be might be law enforcement, I don't know, but um. These are some of the tactics they do. So, you know, be very skeptical of the stuff that relates to this particular camp here, of the IUIC, you know. We even know if this is genuine. I mean, he seems sincere, but you never know, man. You honestly never know with Nathaniel. But um, anyways, everything is coming out to light. You know, some of the things that they do, whether it's false account, dummy accounts, false Instagram and Facebook's accounts to instigate strife and so on and so forth. You can watch the video for yourself. But uh, without further ado, let's get into the, uh, some scriptures. This is Luke 12 and 2. For there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed, neither hid that shall not be known. Right, so, you know, if an individual is committed, uh, you know, sin or wickedness, some way, somehow, the Mosai is going to have that true surface to light. At the end of the day, the Apostle has been saying this for a minute, people are going to know who the true man of the Lord is. It's only a matter of time. You know, we believe sincerely that starts with the Apostles and the Brothers of Great Millstone, not in pride or arrogance, but... Simply because we're doing the things that, um, you know, the elect men would do, you know, and part of that is not dealing, bearing false witness and these types of things. Nobody here is creating dummy accounts to start strife or none of that shit. You know, I personally, my speaking as a man, I really do not care about these other camps and what they do. You know, if they're teaching a false doctrine, you know, you put together a lesson to, 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 to go against the doctrine, but I do not care what these guys personally do anything like that, you know. Don't get, you know, I just, look, again, I'm in Great Millstone. I'm not in these other camps. So that's my priority right here is just focus on the brothers I know. But at the end of the day, you know, that's completely going off. You know, even if even if these dudes are your enemies, you don't put together false witness because now both of you are in the wrong. And, you know, the the brother admitted that, you know. But this is Yahweh Shai working, you know, letting just more telltale signs come out of who's sincere about this thing. You know, this thing is not about rap battles and slandering and creating false information all this type of shit and i'm gonna bring out your address and this is who you live with and this is you know, just that's dumb shit that has nothing to do with the truth man uh, anyways this is luke 8 and 17 for nothing is secret that shall not be made manifest neither anything hid that shall not be done and come abroad right at the ultimately this thing it should be on to edification all right it's not about this thing should just be about edification edifying the elect and that's it first and foremost so if you're doing Anything otherwise, any other false motive, whether you're a demon, uh, outside those camps, or even in here in Great Millstone, the Mosai ultimately will weed you out, man. You know, so you have to be, um, as the scriptures tell you, you can't just be um, worrying about the eyes of men. Because the Mosai, the angels, they're watching everything we do, even our thoughts. So, and yes, we do have impure thoughts. You know, sometimes we think bullshit, but you got to pray and, sh you know, pray for forgiveness and pray those impure thoughts don't come in. Whether you beefing with a brother amongst you or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Just try to keep your your judgment uh, scriptural and not emotional, right? Now, this is uh, Ecclesiastes 12 and 14. For the Moshe shall bring every work into judgment 
with every secret thing, whether it be good or whether it be evil, right, and every secret thing, you know, so, look, at the end of the day, scripture says, put our trust in the most high, Proverbs 3 and 5, and it says, you know, every man, or, you know, every brother will ultimately supplant, so, you know, at the end of the day, we, we, we cool with each other, you know, and we be brotherly to each other, but as far as, you know, trusting the man, like you trust the most high, look, we're not going to, you shouldn't have that mindset until we're on the chariots, because we don't know who's who and what's what until the chariot, until we're on the chariots, then, then we know who are the true friends of the most high, you know, I'm not saying be side eye or look at the next man to you sideways, no, we sincerely be brotherly, but I'm just saying in, in terms of, you know, because, uh, look, man, you, you, you got a lot of things out there that you don't know, that we don't know that the hell is going on, you know, only the angels do, of who's sincere and all those types of stuff, but at the end of the day, we can only do what we got to do to work on our own salvation. That's fear the most high, all right, and love that brother as thyself. So that's just do this work and, and be sincere with it, and, um, you know, the most high will anoint you with the eye salve to see things, man. We can't see everything at the end of the day we men but the point of this lesson is the most high sees everything and he's going to judge a man every man accordingly so the fact that the, the iuic was doing something like this at, at, uh, you know and he did bring out proof so it's not like he's pulling out his ass he, he brought proof out man that they were creating dummy accounts and creating female accounts and you know to to start strife and all this type of shit, man it's, it's you know it's silly but that's what they were doing and the most i had to come to light um, I know for a fact we don't do anything like that here, man. You know, I don't know what the ICPK do. I don't know what these other guys do, but I know here at Great Millstone we don't do no shit like that. This is Romans two and fifteen, um, which show the work of the law written in their hearts, their consciousness also bearing witness, and their thoughts, the mean while accusing or else accusing one another. It says, "In the day when the Most High shall judge the secrets, in what day? The end of days, man." All right, the Mosa in, in in the in the last days that we in, it says in the day when the Mosa shall judge the secrets of men by Yahweh Shai according to my gospel, you know. And if you a sneaky individual and you know you live a long life and perish, guess what? Ultimately, when you go to the heavens, you're gonna sit on the throne of Yahweh Shai and receive according to what you have done. Even if you are no man has seen you know the evils that a particular individual do. When you get judged before Yahweh Shai, they got a long rap sheet. And that judgment is getting played out here on earth. So, you know, you have to have some type of, like this brother above, you have to have some type of guilty conscious. You have to have self-conscious of what you do. You know, you can't just be like sneaky with the most high or try to run around laws and make lo loopholes in laws, you know. I'll be the first to tell you, man, there's, there's times I got to repent of stupid shit like that. Like, nah, look, man, the laws say this or nah, I know the scriptures say this. This is, I'm trying to, you know, I'm trying to, Finesse or some type of shit. Now nah, I gotta do this the right way because I know in my spirit, right from wrong, and you can't get lax. You can't be like, you know, oh, I'm teaching, so that's no, you know what I'm saying? You can't get lax. The most I could judge you at any moment. And the secret things are very important. Uh first Corinthians four and five. It says, Therefore, judge nothing before the time until the Lord come, who both will bring to light the hidden things of darkness. And will make manifest the counsels of the hearts. The Most High is bringing everything to to light on a macro level, not just the stuff that goes on the bullshit between the camps, but you know the, the shit that Esau is doing, the wicked, the nations. The Most High is bringing everything to light. All the darkness, everything in the darkness is where you hide things. People can't see it, but the Most High is shining the light upon that. One with His prophets, Scripture says, "You're the light of the world." All right, via the Urim and Thummim of this internet or, 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 or web. All right. World Wide Web, everything is coming to light on a macro level and a micro level, as we see in here with this video. It says, and will make manifest the counsels of the heart, and the, the your heart or lob is your mind, all right? That's, you know, so really, man, you can't be slick or, hey, man, even amongst ourselves, we can't be low-key niggery or low-key or have any type of, you know, don't squash all that shit, you know? We we gotta be like you know men with each other, okay? Which we are. I'm not saying we're not, but you know. But if, if if a situation like that come up, you know, always examine yourself. Am I doing right in this particular situation? Would you? How should I go about this move? The way I'm going about this move, you know, always fall back on what the scriptures say. 
and that really is a you know that will really solve any uh issues it says will make manifest the counsel of the heart and then shall every man have praise of the most high right so look man at the end of the day we can't you know find grace unto the lord until i mean you know we got to be 100 percent keeping in the fact that look the most high is keeping account and deeds of my actions and i'm not walking like the way yahweh shall walk and i'll tell you right off the bat Yahweh is not going to be making no false accounts and trying to bait people and all that. Yahweh don't do nothing like that, man. So that was off on that. Hey, with that, I'm going to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashim Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashim Rekakodash, the blinds to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone with True Well. Salutations to the whole full elect out there. You Akim to Sadakim that do this thing in their most truth and sincerity. Shalom.